<laughs> Somebody wrote one time about uh, life and how amazing it is sometimes to go through really complex parts of life and to live on the other side of that complexity and simplicity. You have no idea what I'm talking about, that's okay. <laughs> um, but if you go through a hard part of your life and a difficult transition into something more amazing, you know people who've gone through stuff, you know they've gone through stuff. And, uh, and they have this amazing calmness and awareness and love about themselves. And so I was thinking kind of about those things, about the calmness that you have after complexity. Which leads me to Mozart. Actually, it doesn't lead to Mozart. It does. <laughs> but um, I got to sing in Mozart's, um, um, singing in Mozart's Requiem, which was really fun and really hard to do. And I'm really glad there were like seven the other people singing it, because nobody could hear me. Um, and um, there's a part of the Requiem that Mozart um, Mozart, and it's called the Confrontatis, it's part of every Requiem, but his Requiem, um, it sounds a little bit like this, it's the Confrontatis, it's called confusion, badness, horribleness, craziness, disgustingness, kind of thing. But it goes like this. But it's about uh, this bad stuff in the world, and it's like this horrible. And he's getting confrontatis, maledictis. He's like, man, nah, it's coming after you. This horrible thing. But in the midst of that, there is this um, this uh, phrase. These kind of angelic voices sing over top of it. Vokame, vokame, cum benedictus. Call to me, call to me with good words. And it's a beautiful like, um, call uh, over top of this horrible mess. This, I need a blessing, I need to be saved from it. And, uh, and the ending of the Confrontati sounds something like this. Thank you. 